Hey, hey, we're back. <laughs> we're back and picking up right where we left off with this poor guy. Tanner's, uh, Tanner's in bad shape, let me tell you. It's not good. Um, the way we'd kind of left it is, well, we know he's not going to survive. He, he is bitten. That's not a question now. It's bitten, and uh, because of that, there's kind of not too much point in in getting super deep into Tanner's journey. And I'm in two minds right now, so just to kind of level with you, I'm in two minds whether I want to stay on this world with Tanner or with Tanner's, the, t the world that Tanner has helped create, which isn't that much so far, um, or whether I want to create a new character on a new world, because um, I actually forgot in my hurry to start the game, I forgot to do some of the settings that I like to set up, which is, um, I actually like to have the setting where if you've killed zombies in an area, they stay dead. Um, to me it makes the most sense I know that other people won't agree with that or they might think that makes the game easy I disagree um, I just think it makes more sense because um, you clear an area of zombies then they, to me they shouldn't just magically respawn, that's not a real world if you know what I mean and once you've killed an area that's not going to stop other zombies from roaming into that area Um but yeah, I, that's the setting that I prefer to have. And again, there's the argument that, oh, well, what happens if you kill all of the zombies? Um, that's, that's probably not gonna happen. You know, let's be honest. It's, it, it's a big world and it's probably not gonna happen. So we've got our medical supplies, which I'm gonna bring upstairs. Painkillers, tweezers, uh, needle holder. Don't need a medical mask, do we? What else have we got that we can use? I think that's it. Did we have no actual needle? But I'm not sure we actually need a needle. Ooh, what's this? Oh wow, I didn't spot this before. Okay, cool. So we're going to fill up on these medical supplies. Um, like I say, right now I'm still in two minds. So I'm going to kind of think it through whilst we're kind of looting. Got a needle now, which is kind of cool. Um, but I think I know what I want to do. You know, I think, I think I do kind of know that I want to, to do this. Uh, as in create a new world and yeah look at that infected totally just disinfect and put on a bandage but it's I mean let's be honest he's he's gone he's done um, shin's okay now but it doesn't really make a difference so I kind of think let me just, I'm going to put all this stuff up in here. I might change my mind, you know, and, and totally go back on myself. It's just for argument's sake, put all of my medical stuff in here. Okay. What else did I have on me? Not really much. Um, yeah. It's hard to let go. Even, I just have this problem. Even with um, characters that I've really only had for a few seconds really half an hour was it last time and even now I'm still not in a rush to to just give up on him but I kind of I kind of probably have to it's just one of those things 
Um, let's give him some food. I'll give him my last meal. And I'll just quickly turn the music down. Uh, oh, we need to eat the rest of this. All of it. Come on. He's not in pain anymore. He is nervous. Scared. And I don't have any cigarettes, which is probably part of it. And he's obviously scared that he's bit. Uh, do we need some sleeping tablets? Do we have some sleeping tablets? We didn't. Okay. Well, we're not doing any uh, any sleeping, man. Do you know what? I was gonna. The kind of plan was to send him out on maybe like a glorious last stand. Uh, he's not really equipped for a glorious last stand, is Tanner? And I think it's gonna be more time effective if we. Let uh, let Tanner rest here in his house, and in our mind, we'll let him live out his days in peace. Um, I think that's going to be better. He's going to probably turn. Well, we know he's going to turn, but we're going to we're not going to oversee that. Let's go back time like I did before to to do that kind of editing, and the editing that I was doing wasn't even perfect anyway but you know um, okay so go with survivor again and then oh wait is that why if I go next yeah that's why so I need to do custom sandbox okay I think oh it's been so long if I do we picked Mordred, didn't we, last time? Let's stay with it. Okay. Yeah. So back, back. Custom sandbox. Moldra. Next. There we are. Okay. So I need to go to something. Zombie. No. I think it's this one. Yeah, that's the one. Respawn hours. We don't want respawning. Zero. I don't think I actually want anything else different. I want a mini map. Uh, all of this is going to stay the same, I think. Although I don't know if that's actually the default for Survivor. But. I think actually, normal. Okay, okay, right. Range weapons are going to be rare. In fact, everything else is going to be rare, apart from melee weapons and uh, maybe survivalists. Nah, 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 nah. Come on, let's do it proper. Let's do it proper. The only thing we're changing is the respawn. Okay, and I think that's enough of a handicap for my skill level. So, right. Let's do... Let's do Fire Officer this time. Instead of, what was it, Personal Trainer or whatever. We'll do that, yep. Yeah. And we've got zero points right now, so let's go with, uh, we need to be underweight. And da -ba -da -ba -da. let's have a look. Go with Smoker again. It's just an easy one for me to pick, to be honest. Probably go with Hearty Appetite. And let's do Hard of hearing, because I don't think it makes that much difference. Slow reader, because we can fast forward time. And weak stomach, we just need to not eat rotten uh, food. Right? So, okay, we've got a lot of points now. So, we're going to go with... Uh, we've already got sprint in there, but... I, I think I would like to be quite speedy, so we'll possibly go with that. Uh, fast learner, definitely. Uh, yeah. Don't need any of that, really. Uh, underweight. Can we do athletic as well for fitness? Kind of. Do we want that? Or do we want to be stronger? Or do we just kind of go for 
Go for athletic and stout. It's just do I want anything else in particular? Fast learner. Uh, let's do it. Let's do it. We want to be nice and fit. And we've got seven points left. So we can put that. Oh, do we want the carpentry instead? Uh, I don't want to waste too much time. Let's be nice and strong and fit. And then we've got possibly... Okay, I'll add one more. This is the issue I always find myself in, where it's like... Okay, get rid of that. Shot sighted. <laughs> we're back where we were before. Alright, 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 all thumbs. Alright, all thumbs. And he's going to be... Got five points. Well, he could either be a gymnast or a mechanic. He's going to be a gymnast. So, mega fit dude. That's the idea. Uh, next... Todd Joyner, perfect. Don't need to change a single thing about that. Maybe give him a vest and some glasses and a Hawaiian shirt because then he can tear it all up. Oh my days. Fedora, bucket hat. This is, I'm sure this is new stuff. Must be. A baseball cap. Yeah, cool. Right, that's it. I'm not messing around anymore. Play. Done. Let's get into it. Okay. Half this episode has already been swallowed up in character relinquishment and creation. So let's just try and, you know, dig in. Right, okay. Corn beef. Open that, I need to eat that straight away. Because I have set myself up as underweight. I should be able to get rid of that skill pretty, well, skill, handicap pretty quickly. Um, as long as we find some decent stuff. Like this. Oh, wow. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. What is this house? Whoa. It's awesome. Okay. Good start ish. Obviously, the front might be. No, we're not too bad. This is a nice kind of. This is a nice area. If I can level up my carpentry, then. Oh, that's not. Let's not rush outside. Newspaper. Right, let's have a look. Mechanics magazine. Okay. nearly went very wrong. Okay, some spare glasses just in case. I don't think I need any of this, but let's rip all this stuff up. Let's go. Okay. Right, nice. 
Rokidoks, uh... What have we got up here? Farming and cooking. Bit of volumes. Okay, not bad. Give these to hand. I uh, don't really think any of these are any good. No. Nope. Okay. And uh, nothing majorly good up here. Okay, so not a great house. It's not a terrible house in terms of the location. Uh, we've got multiple kind of entries and exits. Rolling pin. I feel like that's not a very powerful weapon, but. But we do have enough now to kind of fend off things. See that? We'll just keep ourselves. Yeah, get that weight up. So we're in a pretty, like a gated community kind of deal. Which suits us just fine. too useful just yet. Watch. Let's clear the area, why not, eh? Check them out afterwards. Matches. Jacket's going to be useful, but the digital watch is definitely what we want. Fog's lifted. Sweet. Okay. Right then. Oh wow. If I can clear out these areas, this is going to give me a lot of breathing space. What's that? Slight damage. From what? Looks like an empty ish house. Let's peek inside. Fancy houses have a higher risk of house alarms going off though, right? Okay, so a few more around here. Take crossover magazine. 
try this door. Fuck. Fucking knew it. Where'd you come from? So if I come right down here. I knew it! What did I say? coming from all over, oh my god. Right, so that's just rendered all my clearing efforts kind of useless. But it has brought all of those zombies into there. If I just hang around here for a little bit, I mean, are they just going to start roaming over this way? Probably. Right. It's kind of problematic. But you, little Miss Backpack, can I just get you? Probably not. Okay. Rough hand. We had it kind of good. And it's kind of gone up in our face. But let's see what we can... Let's see what we can do. Oh, shit. So they're all spreading out. If I just run through here, we'll see what happens. This guy is kind of fresh. If he dies, um, I'll probably end the episode and then just, you know, um, oh, he's still drawing him in. Tell I'm try harding because I'm so quiet. But yeah, if he dies, we'll probably end the episode and then I'll create another character off screen. Um, just so we don't have to, you know, go through all that again. But maybe we've drawn. One there. See, there's still a lot getting drawn that way. Whoops. I don't know what's down this road. Probably nothing. Um, my guy's getting thirsty. He's been thirsty for a while. Are you kidding? Am I just taking him on a merry goose chase? Out of the city? I don't really want that. As much as I've kind of damned the city with that alarm, or at least my spawn. Oh shit! What's this? Train line. Ah oh dear. What have we done now? Eh? 
take this guy on. Why not? Why not? Let's take him on. Might mean that where I think I must have been like kind of central-ish in Muldra. I don't know Muldra well at all. But what I'm thinking is if I've if I've just kind of drawn all of the zombies to that area, then is there a chance that no, no, there's not. That's a trailer park. Tired. Uh, I hate to say it, but I reckon we fucked it. Is the uh, is the technical term? I've exerted myself. I've not brought any food. Um, the spawn that we had, as good as it was, is now useless. And I don't know where I am, so wow. Are you too many? So yeah. with zombies and I'm too tired to do anything about it oh. yeah I reckon this is going to be it for this guy Todd I'm sorry Todd I had such high hopes and then I went and blew it by going into the house which I knew I didn't really want to go into I've got no excuse other than loot greed I see potential solace. It gets countered by hard after hard. Alright. Let's just fucking run as far as we can before he gets too tired. None of these cars are good, they're all wrecks. Fuck you. Sight. But this looks like it's just off into the woodlands. Zombies everywhere. Is this just is this just Muldra? I have heard Muldra's like a crazy place to start because of that. But Oh my god, every time I think maybe I've got a break. Jeez. Alright, tell me. Up here, please. Can I have a break? <laughs> no, is the answer to that. Can I at least get a drink? Confident have fallen. What a terrible, terrible uh, twist. 
Okay, well. We're on hard mode, I guess. Right, this is it. He's gonna try. I was I was this close to giving up on him um, and just starting another character, but he seems to have at least escaped the the ravenous horde for now. Let's. In fact, he's not tired yet, so let's just rest. rest for now. Get his exertion down, which is gone. It's gone, but it's not totally, like, solved. I'm going to sneak around for now. Take those out and let them defrost. And then shall we... Check out this other house to log out. Two bags as well, but I mean, we're just gonna get greedy. Okay. Nothing I can tear up these. No. So I can rip the clothing. Oh, rip the pants. Okay. Cover the front, really. Okay, so we've got a little bit. It's not amazing, but we can work with it. bit sad and agitated but right now he is safe which we couldn't say earlier
Right, I've forgotten how to make um, like curtains, but that's okay. I can I can learn. I can remember how to do that. Kind of off off camera or off recording. So for now, this is it. We're gonna pause it here. We'll come back and see just how far Todd can make it. At least he's not bitten at the end of the episode, so there's a difference. Um, he had a rough start in that he had the perfect kind of area that ended up getting fucked with the alarms, but it's just how it goes on projects on Boyd. So yeah, I will. Uh, I'll catch you in the next one. And uh, yeah, thanks for thanks for watching.